Right, a cold front passed through and it really kicked up our wind. It's very dry outside too. You walk across the grass and it just crunches down. And because of the dry conditions, windy uh, conditions as well, you combine those and that's why we have a red flag warning across the upstate until 8 o'clock tonight, meaning that if you started a fire, it would spread very, very quickly. So no burning until uh, advised that you can do so because this is not a good situation and also all that smoke in the air, it's not good for those uh, when, with COVID as well. 44 for your morning temperature in the upstate. It is going to be a cold one once this cold front really settles in. 44 for Greenville, 32 up in Asheville, 36 in Hendersonville, mostly clear skies. And we're going to stay with temperatures below the norm for this time of year, at least through Sunday. And then temperatures will start to warm up. Notice the lightning bolt there on Sunday. Sunday night, we could see some stronger thunderstorms and some rain throughout the day on Easter Sunday. But right now, completely rain free. And that's a good thing after what we had uh, going into last night and early this morning. 81 in Greenville, 73 up in Asheville. 64 the current temperature in Waynesville, but then you head farther to the south. That cold air really is not taken over at all. 82 in Lawrence and Newberry. So for Friday morning, we're going to start in the 40s, even some 30s as we talked about and only get to 51 in the mountains, 62 for the upstate and breezy. This is a 20 degree drop in temperatures, so you are really going to notice the difference with all that sunshine. We're giving it a nine. We're not too far off from the norm for this time of year, and I think I will kind of enjoy the refreshing day. So cool and breezy on Friday. Saturday looks great. Get outside, take advantage. And then as we go into Sunday, that's when things change. Here's 1 p.m. Afternoon is when we'll have the better chance of rain moving in and then the potential for storms as you see these yellow colors popping up here between about 10 p.m. and possibly through around 4 or 5 in the morning on Monday morning. Something we're really going to have to watch out for and we'll keep you posted as to the time frame of any severe weather and when the heaviest rain is going to threaten. But right now it looks like a washout for Easter except for the very early morning. I've talked to some of you on Facebook and on phone calls about services early if you're doing dry drive up services perhaps uh, or egg hunts with the kids. Morning looks okay, but afternoon and evening look like a soaker.